Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the Art Playground. Today I wanted to do a coffee page. And I have it in this book that I'm dedicating to, um, it's a Stillman and Burn, the beta series, and it's going to be the creations I make through 2021 for WOW embossing powders. So these are the first two I've done. I will add in all the details here. I'm just waiting for a swatch stamp set that I ordered. And I'll create a little panel. But today we're going over here. I was going to do a Mad Hatter kind of inspiration, but I think I'm going to do something different over here. I might add some other details in here later on. I am going to be using this stamp set by Tim Holtz. It is the Mini Cirque Alpha number CMS079. And then I have my WOW powders over here and my little swatch sheet see which colors I want to use and a cup of coffee a cold cup of coffee from this morning get that down okay we're gonna make an art cafe art cafe are you ready are you ready everyone and I'm gonna start by doing the stamping and then I'm gonna be doing painting the coffee Clear embossing pad. Make sure they're nice and juicy. And then we need cafe. I was thinking of doing them on separate paper and then cutting them out and placing them in, but I think I want this kind of a flat page since my last two were bulky. Okay. You know what I'm going to do in the navy and keep it dark because then we can make the coffee colors, those fun ones. Spare piece of paper. I think I pressed a little too hard on my tea. <laughs> I really smushed that one down. Okay. Let us grab the heat gun. Yeah, I did smush my tea down a wee bit too hard, but it's so pretty. Okay, let's put these letters away. I don't want a pencil. Pencil, pencil. I'm just going to mark the edge of my cup. Now normally I would let the coffee sit out for a couple days, but I forgot to save old coffee, <laughs> so I just have it from this morning. If you let it sit out for a couple days in a cup with nothing in it, nice and clean, It'll get more intense, the colors, plus it makes your book smell great. Because my coffee is so light, I'm just speeding it along with the heat gun.
just want to add a bit more brightness before I add the other embossing colors. So I've grabbed my Quar, it's Q-O-R is the brand name, and it's Cobalt Teal. I just kind of want to do it around my letters a bit. Just kind of bring those blues out. Get some water down. Grab some cobalt teal. What colors? Actually, actually, before we do colors, let's doodle. Oh, I thought that was finer. See this one. I'll show you what it looks like before I add the embossing powders. So they're just very loose doodles. They're very loose. Okay, let's choose our powders. I'm going to play with the rinkies. Need my embossing pen. Scrap piece of paper. Let's use the blush as blush. Make sure the tip is clean. I think I need to use Diana's Love in the hearts. I want to use this on the bunny's ears and nose. Put some dots in his tail. Let's heat gun that before we go any further. Just so our ink doesn't dry out on us, our embossing pen. I think we should do a bunch of little hearts because it's a month of love. This one we're using the Ula's Cognac. One thing I might want to add, big old heart. A little of Diana's love again. Enjoy your coffee in new ways. Yay! <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that. It's just a little fun playtime, trying something a little different. So try something new. Experiment. Experiment is good. Experimenting is good. I just want to get these all on the screen so you guys can see them. It's a good little visual reference in case 
you have some of the same supplies or want to get some of the same supplies and use them in your work. I will see you guys on the next video. I had fun. I hope you had fun. I created a little wonderland. There is no Alice because Alice is on the other two pages. <laughs> Don't know how much longer I'll keep doing Alice, but I'm still having fun with her and her friend. So I'm going to keep going with that for a little while intermixed with some other fun creations. See you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.